ceiling right there. This guy right here. There's a computer chip in the knee right here. Microprocessors communicating with sensors down here in the pylon where your ankle would be at, where your foot is right down here. And also sensors in the knee. And it is sending information to the microprocessor and that's analyzing your pressure on your heel and your toe. It knows when you're walking, it's gonna take, your, if you, as you're walking, it's gonna take all that information. It's gonna go right here to the hydraulic. It's gonna adjust the hydraulic depending on how, how you're walking, how fast you're walking, uh, the train you're walking on. I can go outside, walk down stairs, step over step, walk down a hill, walk on the terrain, train, and it's, uh, it's gonna, I can trust the need to be there for me. So how, it's not how really long? walking for me, but it's, it's gonna react to how I'm walking. How long have you been using these? Five years now. What, uh, is, there like, is there a learning curve uh, for something uh, like that? I mean, depending on older technology yeah. that doesn't have the stability and safety, you do kind of have to teach yourself how to walk a little differently. I'll show you how it works. Build your endurance, and you, know, you gotta get your balance and stuff. But if, if it wasn't for this technology in the, in the prosthetic knee, I wouldn't have the independence and mobility skills I do today.